Wow, that's a big one. Oh my god. <laughs> give us a menu of the wine and beer list and alcohol. So here is the California Grill Special, which is a very expensive cocktail, it's $137. But this is what all the drink comes with. They have the ice wine martini. Magnus is gonna get the uh, blackberry sour here. And here are the different types of other cocktails that they have. And these are the prices next to them. They also have sake here which is I did not know and yeah it's really cool and it's by the bottle so these are the prices for the sake and we have the beer and hard cider list which I think I'm gonna get the Belgian golden ale here and here is the list of the beers and there's a lot of wine here to choose from you got your sparklings here your Salmon Blancs Riesling interesting whites rosés Syrahs, Ziffendales, Interesting Reds, Cabernet Sauvignons, Merlots, and your Pinot Noir. So lots of options here for vine also. So this beautiful blackberry sour comes with Kettle One, uh, Searching Vodka, Housemade Lemonade, and Blackberries. Ooh, that looks so Look refreshing. At Look at how pretty it is. Yes. I'm just excited for the cocktail. <laughs> Let's, let's go ahead and first oh taste impressions here. Look at this. This is so pretty. It's like I don't even want to drink it. So I can imagine <laughs> the flavor. Let me. Let's start on this side. All right. Ooh. You can taste there's alcohol in it. Oh yeah, of course. Do you taste more blackberries I in the sour? I can taste the blackberry. It's kind of sweet and sour at the same time. Oh wow. And you can taste that, like a little bit of the lemonade in there mm -hmm. too. This is very refreshing and yeah. very delicious. Recommend that drink? Oh yeah, I do recommend this drink. So here's my Duvel Belgian Golden Ale. I love how it looks. Look at all the bubblies here. I love golden, uh, lighter beers. I'm not yeah. more of a dark guy, but I love this. I look how it looks. So let me go ahead and try this out. Let me see. Let me look at it. Oh, look yeah. at that. Look at that foam in yeah. there. <laughs> that looks amazing. All the right. color looks beautiful, babe. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Wow. It's like a sweet bitter, right? It hits you right in the beginning and it smooths off at the end. So if you like these types of beers, the golden ale, the Belgian golden ale, I definitely recommend it. So you do scan the QR code like all the Disney restaurants. Uh, let me just show you quickly the menu. There's your pizzas here. They have the pepperoni, four cheese. They're also known for their hand-rolled sushi. 
You're getting the combination California roll, which has the jumbo lump crab, avocado cucumber, and shrimp tempura. I love shrimp tempura. Here's the different types of sushi they have here. They have soups and salads. Uh, I think we're also gonna get the, let me see here. Actually, let me click right on here. And then we're gonna get also the uh, short rib wonton, which sounds excellent. Uh, for entrees here, they have fish. They have the steaks here. They have pork tenderloin, lamb loin, and pasta. And then for desserts, there's a selection of desserts right here. With the grandma near souffle, looks really good. And this restaurant is also very kid friendly. As you can see, they do have kids appetizers, chicken noodle soup, parts of romaine. You can choose you create your own meal for the kids. They also have the, the beef tenderloin, glazed chicken, mac and cheese, which kids love the mac and cheese. And there you go. So, you know, this also has great restaurant for families and children alike. So they do offer bread. They offer some beautiful sourdough bread. Oh my God, look at this. Eat. I'm unwrapping this and wow. it looks so pretty. It looks like fresh from the bakery, fresh. Oh yeah, look at look at this. Oh my God, and it's so crunchy. <laughs> but this wow. is what they give as a starter here. And they also give this beautiful tomato and olive oil dressing here, this dip. So let's go ahead and try that with the dip. Okay, I'm gonna try the little toasty part. Yeah. Oh, look at the chunks of tomato there. Oh my god. Mm. Oh my god, this is so good. Look at that. Mm. Wow. I feel it's crunchy already. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. How delicious is that? The bread is nice and warm. Mm -hmm. It's very toasty and crunchy. I don't know if you heard me crunch. <laughs> With that, the sourdough inside is nice and soft and warm. And with that olive oil and tomato, it enhances the flavor, together, right? Together, oh my god, it's like a tingy but olivey flavor. Oh, but it's like so good. I've never had anything like olive oil and tomato mixed together, and this is just fantastic. I really enjoy this. This is really, really good. Our sushi has arrived. Uh, we got the California combination, four, com four sushi rolls, California rolls, and four uh, tempura rolls here. And it comes with this tangy uh, mango sauce. It's a mango flavored sauce. We have our soy sauce ready for dipping. Yeah, and I even like the little bottle for the soy sauce. <laughs> it is so adorable. Look, Look at, at it. That's awesome. It's adorable. <laughs> Let me go ahead and try this California roll here with my chopsticks. <laughs> Let me dip it in the sauce here. The first, the mango one here. Let's try it. Oh wow! That's like a sweet, like a sweet mango sauce. So you're correct on that, babe. Really good. Mm. Now, let me just try it with the soy sauce. With the soy sauce. Mm. I do like it better with the soy sauce. But the rice is fresh, soft, the crab meat delicious, the avocado. Oh, I gotta say one word, the sushi is fresh. Excellent. Now Magnus is gonna try the shrimp tempura. See how that tastes. You try with the mango sauce first, Magnus? I'm gonna do it together. Oh, you're daring. <laughs> All right, let's see how it is. Okay, With Ready? both the sauces. Mm. How how fresh is that is that shrimp? Oh wow! I think not because we're in the California grill, but I think out of all the shrimp tempuras that I've had, this is this is the bomb. <laughs> and the mixture of that mango flavored sauce goes well with the soy sauce, huh? Yeah, because you know the shrimp's already a yeah. little bit sweet. Yeah, it gives it that extra oomph. And then with the sock with the soy sauce. The soy sauce. Oh. So sweet and salty. This is sweet and salty. I really like it. <laughs> awesome. This is really delicious. Wow. Over here we got the short rib wontons. Oh my god, I look it looks so, so delicious. delicious. And I love the presentation. Moist. Yeah. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna try it here. With my chopsticks. 
the perfect bite. Mm. Oh wow. It's like everybody says it's good. A little spicy in the beginning, it gives it has a little kick, but the meat is so soft and tender and the and the wonton, the, the shell of it, soft also. How about oh, that wow. sauce? That's, the sauce is delicious also. I tell you, once you put it in your mouth, it melts in your mouth. That's how good these short rib wontons are. Wow. Well, I definitely recommend it. A little spicy in the beginning, but it's really good. It's excellent. Going for it. Go for it. <laughs> wow, that's a big one. See, they're a little, they're a little spicy in the beginning, right? Mm. A little kick in the beginning. I don't feel it that bad. Yeah. A little bit. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> That's, that's two oh my gods. One more. <laughs> Doesn't oh it melt in your mouth like I said? That is the best wontons I have ever had yes. in my life. I'm sorry to say. Highly recommend. It is sweet, soft, and I like the sauce, the meat flavor. The short rib flavor is sweet with a little kick. I can feel a little heat, but it's nothing like you cannot eat. And I tell you that because I don't really like spicy food a lot. But if it's light kick, I definitely, definitely recommend this. This is fantastic. So our entrees have arrived. Babas did get the black grouper. It comes with the herb, uh, basmati rice, chewy, uh, excuse me, ca <laughs> cashew chutney, lobster, bok choy, uh, baby shiitake, and green curry coconut uh, nage or naje. Mm. Um, that looks really good. That's a lot. And of it lot. smells delicious. Yeah, it looks mm. <laughs> I did get the 20 ounce bone in ribeye steak. It comes with potato cheese, croquettes, grilled onions, malt vinegar only, and triple garlic butter. Wow, that steak looks delicious. Man, we're gonna go ahead and try her grouper. That looks so good. Mm. Mm, the rice. Ooh, let me get like, <laughs> I think some lobster here too oh wow it's like a that little sauce that comes with it i forgot the name so sorry good. i'm not a fish fan so myself good. but that looks delicious look at that look at that lobster oh. how delicious is that grouper it's nice and soft it doesn't even taste fishy and it's sweet the rice is kind of sweet I think it's the sauce. The sauce really, uh, yeah. That's kind of sweet. Yeah. And the lobster tastes so good. It's a lobster mm. and fish. Wow. Yeah, it's lobster and fish combination. Yeah. And the rice is nice and soft. It's really good. So it, I definitely recommend, and I love bok choy. Because it has uh, a bok choy. Yeah. Bok choy is one of my favorite Asian uh, veggies. So it's really, really good. Let me go ahead and try to tackle this big 20 ounce steak. Look it's at, huge. <laughs> yeah, look at look at Paul trying to eat this big fat steak here. Oh my God! Look at how huge. Look, it's this really is big. just in the camera. <laughs> if I go back, ooh, look at how huge that is. It's plate uh, size. Yes, I did get a medium well. I like a little pink inside the my meat. All right. There you go. Medium well was the way to go. The meat's cooked. Perfection. It's so tender. Mm. It's like butter. <laughs> That's wow. how good it is. It looks good and it looks, look at that. Wow. It looks so, look at all the juices. He's cutting it. Let me put it up close here. And look at the juices flowing out of that steak. Wow. So good. Mm. Like I said, this is the way to go. If you like steak, the ribeye is delicious. Let me try this croquettes here, the potato croquettes. Let me cut into it. Ooh, that looks nice and nice and good. What's yeah, that sauce that. in here? Let me put it up close there a little bit. Oh wow, that looks delicious. Mm -hmm. Let me go ahead and take a bite out of these croquettes here. Mmm. Fried outer shell, creamy inside. Like a cheesy kind of taste. Mmm. It's like a new spin on your meat and potatoes. It really has good. like a like a mayo sauce there. Like so a mayo. Try, mm -hmm. try it with that. Try a little bit with that. It looks really good. 
I yeah. think that's why it's for there too. There you go. Mm. Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh, it gives that extra oomph. Mm. Yep. Delicious. Me potatoes can't go wrong. <laughs> and of course, I have to get the cheers. <laughs> My sweet Moscato sparkling wine. So I asked the, the, the server, the waitress, um, if there was anything sweet, fruity, kind of like what I had in Topolino, which is kind of like a sparkling wine, which I really enjoy. And she brought me this, like, it's like, a, it's a Moscato, but it's sweet. It is so good. And it's perfect paired with my fish, with my grouper. Perfect. Cheers. So, so far, Three, four dessert comes our way. How was the dinner? <laughs> I can't even move. <laughs> <laughs> Likewise. <laughs> the grouper was amazing. Yes. So it was. I even tasted the grouper good. myself. Yeah. And I don't like fish, and that tasted good. It really good. <laughs> Your steak was. You had to help me with the huge. steak, right? Yeah. I had to help. I had to give him a little bit of help because <laughs> I was full myself, but I had to help him and. That steak is not cheap. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I said. Let me help him because that's a big steak. It was so juicy, yeah. so tender. And it was nice and like melt in your savory. mouth. Flavorful, so. savory. It was really good. The appetizers are all wonderful. They were delicious. Mm -hmm. I mean, the cocktail that I had was delicious. My wine. Yeah, she loves is her wine. Fantastic. So far, everything's been excellent. The food has been excellent. Yeah. So now, dessert to finish off the day. Yeah, something lighter. <laughs> something definitely lighter. <laughs> so Magnus went with the Grand Marnier Souffle. Uh, it's a Grand Marnier Allegaze with macerated oranges. And it does have alcohol. So let's go ahead and they said to go ahead and pop the top and put in the, uh, the syrup inside. Ooh. Okay, I see the, I see all the hot. You see the smoke coming out of it? Oh yeah. It's hot. Ooh, I can smell the orange. And then you go ahead and dip in. Wow. Oh my god, that looks so good. And they have a little piece of orange here on the side. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. It smells so good and you can see the smoke and everything. Wow. And oh, when yeah, it tastes. I see that steam see coming right steam? up. Yeah. Wow. Alrighty, first taste impressions. Oh my goodness. Later. I wanted something light. I didn't know this was going to be so big. <laughs> oh my god, it smells so good. Oh, it's a little hot. <laughs> How's wow. it taste? It just melts in my mouth. And it's hot, so you got to be careful if you get this. It's very hot. And with the, the little cream, oh my god. I think that's the alcohol and the cream in there. Yep. Look at that. So good. What does it taste like? Is it orangey? It's orangey. Kind of like a lemon cake. Lemon, yeah. But with the cream, like the very cream. creamy. The cream is where the alcohol is. And warm, yeah. yeah, it's so good. It just melts. I don't need to. I don't need to bite nothing. Need to do nothing. <laughs> so I did get the white peach and bay leaf sorbet. It does have a lemon pound cake, chantilly cream, peach gel, and the vanilla compressed peaches. Wow. Ooh, look at those peaches. Yeah, and I love sorbet. So. Oh, I love the the the, way the presentation. Yeah, with a little flower right there. <laughs> yeah, one thing I love is the presentation of all the food. It's beautiful. Delicious. Can't wait to try it. Look at that. Look at up close here, guys. Look at that fat peach right there. <laughs> Dip into this sorbet here. Oh, the sorbet's kind of tough here. <laughs> oh, because it's ice it's sorbet. It's frozen. Yeah, it's frozen. That's right. And we're going to try it with so a little peach good. right here. Yeah, big, big bite here. See there? Mmm. <laughs> Cold? Yeah. Compared to mine, it's warm and then yours is hot. Super cold. I mean, uh, cold. Let me get the pizza escape for me. Cheers. The peaches are fresh. The sorbet, frozen. 
It's very cool. Mixed with the cake here. Look at that. Mm. It's a good combination. I'm surprised. Not bad. I was expecting just a sorbet by itself, but mixed with the cake and the peaches. I recommend it if you like sorbet. Really good. Everything was amazing at the California Grill. We're ending it here on the observation deck. Yeah. We're ready to see a uh, special fireworks. Special event. <laughs> special <laughs> event fireworks. Stay tuned for that. We're going to see a little glimpse of it from the yeah. observation deck here. But overall, how was the food? Oh, how was the experience? The food was amazing. Good company. Mm. Everything <laughs> was amazing. Yeah, it was awesome. The food, the appetizers, the entree. Yeah. The dessert, the service, the view of the of every park up in the yeah. observation deck. Excellent. Everything was excellent. There was no complaint. This restaurant does have a dress code. Oh, and yes. did, we did notice a lot of people were not well dressed for the occasion, if yeah, I can say so it. Like they said that. yeah, a lot of people weren't dressed for the California grill, but I guess the dress code they haven't they don't enforce it as much. So mm -hmm. just be aware if you want to come in shoes or sneakers or shorts, uh, they that you can, all you can, but they they on the dress code that says no flip flops, but people were wearing flip flops. Yeah, we even saw people that had their pool attires in a fancy <laughs> dining California grill. We yeah, were like so, taken back by that, but so just be aware okay. if you want to come comfortable, you can. But if you want to dress up nice, you can also. So yeah, but overall we had a magtastic time. <laughs> Always magtastic. Yeah, it was really good. We had a lot of fun, and we will definitely try and make it back. However. Just to let you know, it is a little expensive mm -hmm. here. It is pricey, so yeah, our meal was like two fifty. Yeah, about two fifty. Yeah, but we did a lot of a little alcoholic drinks, and yeah. I did order a big steak also. So it's, yeah. it is pricey uh, compared to Topolinos. I think Topolinos it felt a little bit more fancier, yeah. the atmosphere. But it's this is I say it's high end casual here yeah. at the California Grill. Well, we so. still loved it, but I would if I had to pick between California Grill and Topolinos, I say Topolinos is a little bit more high end. Yeah, if you want more, a little bit more fancy more atmosphere, more fancier yeah. atmosphere, a little bit more relaxed, then yeah. I would pick Topolinos. If you did enjoy this vlog, remember to like, share, and subscribe. subscribe. Well, with that, it was a fantastic time. Yeah, it was a. Great time. <laughs> well, the guys, thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next Mag Tastic Productions. Bye, Bye guys. <laughs>